Hi, my name is Mark and I teach economics. Oh, you got me again. I'm out in my garden. In this video, why am I here? In this video, we're going to talk about what are capital goods. Now, in my class, I often use the term capital and the interrelationship between capital and interest rates. But then when I ask my class, they're all nodding their heads. They can't define capital. So I think we need to do a special session to drill down on what a capital good is. The adage is you need money to make money. If I had the capital, I'd start a restaurant in downtown St. Augustine, I'd get rich. Is that true or false? I'd have to say false for that one because a lot of times people think capital is synonymous with money, cash. Capital is not money. Capital are tools. That's what capital is. See this hoe? This is a cheap hoe. I love this cheap hoe. It's capital which I use to enhance my garden, to grow things. This is capital. This is a machete. I clear the jungle in my backyard. I never thought I'd be living in a jungle until I moved down here. And this is one of my ch favorite forms of capital. It's almost an extension of my arm. It's tools. Capital are tools which I use to enhance the production process. How does this relate to economics? Think about Y equals C plus I plus G. I is the investment component. Although it's the smallest between C and G, I is the most sensitive. What is it sensitive to? It's sensitive to interest rate movements. When interest rates are low, people spend a lot of money on capital. Even me. I'm not talking about a bank loan, but I put this cheap hole on my credit card. I got it down the street at Tractor Supply, and it's great for me. When interest rates are high, I'm going to think twice about going to uh, the feed store down the street or the supply store down the street to get capital goods even if it results in greater productivity. Now there's different ideas in this capital. You, why don't I just buy a tractor and make my field more profitable and productive? Well, when you're considering capital, you have to look at all the effects. A large tractor is a highly leveraged investment and I'm going to be paying interest on that for a very long time. So it cuts into the total cost of my production and productivity. That's why an average farm field makes about $500 an acre. However, if you have an acre with hand tools and small scale capital, you can make 100,000 an acre. It's your choice. So there's a lot of ideas here, but the main connection I want you to make is capital is not money. Capital are tools. It can be intellectual capital, you can use your smarts or physical capital, but it is the tools which you used to enhance the production process. In later videos, we're going to talk about Mises and the capital lengthening process. But for now, this is what you need to know to make sure that you understand capital is related to the interest rate, or at least capital expenditures. So thank you very much, and I'll have more videos. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button, like it, comment. Thank you. Have a great day.